Exceptional. The movement is outstanding. The Black Cat lies through. Brilliant! Brilliant goal! Two! Black Cat lies through. Brilliant! Brilliant goal! Detecting deepfakes is a tough task. Are you worried that you won't be able to tell a real video from a fake one? How do you feel about it? Wow, wow, Wes. Cat scoring a goal? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 I saw yeah, yeah, this. Yeah. has Chris written all over it. <laughs> Chris is going to love this. Cat Wait, scoring dude, a goal. Dude, is this uh, that autistic dude that says, like, yes, mundane yes. shit? Yeah. Brood. It walks off like it's something yeah. intense. There's a crazy <laughs> event happening this weekend. <laughs> Have we begun? Dude. Have we begun? We've only just Dude, did we ever did we ever even stop? That's Dude, the I, question from last week. That's the question. <laughs> <laughs> this is big. <laughs> Dude. Oh, was it? Just a cat scoring a goal. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Autism watch. That's fucking did you send Is that it? real? No, 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 no. Oh, no. Turn, start over. Start over. Start over. Holy <laughs> shit. Yeah. Yeah. Cat so, ran on the pitch, <laughs> put it up for 90. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He beat the goalie. With a tail flip. Yeah. yeah. I didn't see the other players. I thought it was, it was tough. It was tough. Dude, a, a tough cat angle. can do that. Dolphins can do it. Dolphins easily. Yeah, my dad's on the cat. It's crazy what they could do these days. Uh, but I don't yeah. deny anything. The, the coolest stuff is found every day. A cat wandering on a cat scoring on goal in soccer. I'm like, that definitely happened. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> the first time I watched it, I did. I, I had a moment where I was like, you can't train a cat. To, uh, yeah, I, the first it. time you see it, the yeah. first time the ball hits, and yeah. you're like, maybe that happened. Yeah. I have a child's brain. It's been goal, proven. Like they purposely hit him. Or, yeah, the ball was just going by, and he it hit just it. just a nice touch. touch. I've seen some dogs touch. skateboarding. Yeah. I've seen some dogs surfing. I've seen some dogs <laughs> yeah. sitting on the front of a surfboard. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> leaning into a skateboard on a fucking cat. boardwalk. Right, a, a cat hitting a fucking upper <laughs> <over 90. laughs> It was going so fast. The rest of the thing was a cat at a press conference. <laughs> <laughs> it <laughs> is funny. Right? Was, yeah. Watching like a fat security guard Fuck. try and catch like a raccoon on a baseball field. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, fucking yeah. Funny. yeah that's good stuff. I was watching, yeah. There's some good animals on animals on field compilations on youtube you can treat yourself to that can we just bleep what the cat did so we no one knows no no, no, no. in fact we're gonna attach <laughs> the, the, the intro, the intro. <laughs> i'll send you the video that's yeah. the intro <laughs> the cat scoring a goal. No way, a cat can... <laughs> uh, how the heck are you guys but dude? yeah both you guys have been sending me that South, Af Creek. South African guy, <laughs> I assume. Yeah. He's so fucking funny. It's, he's he's hilarious. locked on to it the way you're locked on to cat, the cat videos. Cat videos are... I can't get enough of this guy. Did Every you, 10 minutes, he's like, I, I, this I hate him. Did I send you the one with the Prince Harry? Him. Prince yes. Harry gave up a whole yes. nation for his girlfriend. Yeah. <laughs> Don't you dare settle for anything than total yeah. commitment. His comments are just, it's just <laughs> ladies being like, oh my God, finally a nice guy. <laughs> I know, I know. He just it's, it's them doing gorgeous, instead of like hot guys being, you know, Pedro Salinas, gorgeous. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. just, it's well, just fucking girls being like, gorgeous. it's about time guys stand up for what's <laughs> right. <laughs> But he's also like he's it's so transparent, like what he's it? going through. Like there'll be one where he's like, he's like, you fuck with my family. You fuck with me. And then the next one will be like, listen, don't just ghost me. Don't. <laughs> it's just like, Dude, he's you just ghost just me. I ghost you. Yeah. Yeah, you yeah, left me on red. I leave you yeah, on he's red. Like, you'll tell when my love is gone. Yeah. He's like, if I don't reply immediately. <laughs> Dude, I've he's wearing just on. like a Bart Simpson hoodie. There's like I Bart Simpson that, on That's a, apparently like an $800 shirt from Balenciaga. Sure. <laughs> sure. Someone sure. told me that and I went, fuck, what the hell? <laughs> Dude, he's a sociopath who just reads bumper stickers and like they're powerful. Yeah. And then walks off. It's like, dude, what I are mean, you I've doing? gone on to watch his YouTube vlog, and I think it's very illuminating. Yeah, he's just yeah. a hot dumb guy. <laughs> he's a hot dumb guy who's plugged into a thing, and it's just it's like all you can do these days is if you get like you got to get super jacked, and then you can just walk around and put on like cool kid clothes. Yeah, and <laughs> say something stupid. Yeah, yeah. He's got like five hundred thousand followers. It's a highly profitable endeavor. 
He's a yeah. consultant. He's I consultant. actually love girls. <laughs> <laughs> and if you were with me, I would be nice to you and I would never be mean. I've got like, a couple yes. of these. There's versions of it that is like Western guys. I get cowboys. I get oh. hot cowboys. Oh, yeah, yeah I guys with like guy. cowboy hats. Yeah, yeah. Like yeah, I mean it's <laughs> it's like the what I would uh, wear on my first date with you. It's a cowboy guy. It's a Christian cowboy. Just right? riding, yeah, a, Christian riding cowboy. a horse. The romance yeah. novels for the modern age. Yeah, they're just the deconstructed romance. Yeah. Novels. They also do those. Just, There's females that are romance novel authors that make Instagram reels. I was in that hole for a while. Wait, what? One girl <laughs> is like a hockey groupie, so she only writes romantic novels for like hockey. <laughs> so it'll be like when your boy, when boards. your boyfriend versus your ex boyfriend meet on the ice, and it's just like a hockey clip <laughs> of two guys fighting. <laughs> I feel like people that write romance novels, there's no way they're good in bed. You know what I mean? They're just fantasizing about being good in bed. I bet they're pretty. That's good. all I do. <laughs> <laughs> That's all you can do, dude. Being good in bed. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like they're, they're, they're describing these sexual encounters. It's like they've probably never been, you know, fingered in the woods. No, I bet they're. Maniacs. They probably blush. I'd imagine they blush. I mean, just imagine fingering your third grade English teacher. That's yeah. All. It's easier they to write. Bl- <laughs> <laughs> well, it's easier to write. I remember which one it was. It's like, oh. <laughs> it is a blush. I think she's blustered. passed away. Did, was there any of your teachers in grade school you would have taken down? Oh, 100%. Yeah. I, my art teacher, I, I think she was grooming me. Really? Yeah. What yeah. was she doing? She would come to my house personally and we'd We're going to put macaroni lessons. on your penis, Tommy. <laughs> <laughs> Stacey, yeah, dude, she was talking you like. You had an art teacher that came and gave you private lessons? Yes. Whoa. Yes, and she would like she would like get you close. Oh, yeah, you're good at art. Yeah, really good good yeah, thanks. Oh, that'd she, be awesome for an art teacher. <laughs> It'd be funny if that's how all the guys in the Renaissance were, which is Tommy's. <laughs> so you want me to fucking? What do you want on that roof? <laughs> <laughs> Just taking yeah, beer I'll breaks because my neck hurts from yeah. painting the ceiling. Look at, his, look at his little pecker. <laughs> <laughs> Put a little pecker on. <laughs> Everybody's got small dicks on purpose. <laughs> Fuck them. If I gotta live with it, he dies. <laughs> And not one hog. On I made a little... fucking flying machine. You can, it spins around. You fly. <laughs> Wapple Angelo. Yeah, dude. <laughs> it does seem like something Tommy would come up. It's literally a corkscrew. Yeah, it's top it's of t- like a Michelangelo fruit designed Da Vinci. <laughs> da Vinci yeah. He can go fuck himself. Those designs suck. <laughs> <laughs> Every one of the drawings is like something I came up with in like fifth grade. <laughs> he was he was Musk for back in the day. He was coming up with like futuristic weapons. Yeah, yeah he dude. was. You guys got to see some of my bar napkin drawings. They're, fucking, they're out there. Yeah, your drawings you are good. Too. Your painting's good. I saw it. I, Thanks, admi- I admired your art. I said, wow. That's nice. <laughs> I'll bring it up here. I yeah, I'd it. like that. We need some. Yeah, I need some more art. Wow, wow, Wes. This is the teacher I wanted to fuck. Yeah, you should name her on this. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> She'd love to hear She's probably it. dead yeah. by now or something. Think she's dead? <laughs> Mm. Self-inflicted, or you think old age? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, but she looked exactly like Pam Anderson. Uh, there's no yeah, way. That's she did. true. You're to fucking me, tiny to me, lens, yeah. to me yeah. she looked exactly like she had blonde Anderson. hair and tits. I'm about to blow yeah. the whistle. Go to the Goog. Yeah. <laughs> People are gonna find this one. <laughs> gonna find her obituary, dude. She's true. dead. No, she's Definitely changed dead. her name multiple times. <laughs> what? I don't know. Oh. <laughs> I don't know. There's no way they're gonna find her. Yeah, we had an eighth grade teacher with. She was old, but she had giant tits. Mm. Yeah. And it made everyone, everyone was like, she's so hot. Yes, yeah, dude. It's crazy how she was not hot. Yeah. But you're <laughs> At 13. The time, you it got was like, this water is the best. Tits, yeah. dude, it doesn't matter Giant what you look tits. like. We had a certified babe when I was in eighth grade. The fifth grade teacher was a certified babe. And I used to like disrupt you her. Found her already. <laughs> you found her already. That's it. Uh, I don't know. It might be. Definitely. Yo, I, oh, I, dude. That's babe teacher. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh really? Yeah. Oh, Connor, it up, dude. Just, Connor, how's that <laughs> geometry we'll be, going? We'll be name. <laughs> Set it no, up. You seriously could we probably bet. take her. Down. I don't want to. If she has a family, I don't disrespect her, but like, you could probably take her down now. I bet, Connor. I bet. What's stopping you, dude? Um, yeah. What is she tutoring? Uh, social studies. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, but they, dude, I forget there. all the capitals. He's, like, He's gotta, getting worked up. I know, yeah, yeah. dude. I've forgotten all the Stacey. capitals. I need help. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's a Cavill Tyler Bangkok. <laughs> Let's kiss. <laughs> <laughs> what you looking? What you seeing? What's your marital status, dude? Get to the goods. 
Dude, that'd be so hot. You'd be like Macron from France. I don't think it would matter if she knew it was you. <laughs> we had some lesbian teachers too. They were t- there was two. And yeah, they're they... called gym teachers. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, 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 they were math. They were math. True, true. They were dog the bounty teachers. hunters. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, we had a dog the bounty hunter gym teacher. I think she wore like wraparound Oakleys. <laughs> Oh, dude, we had a gym teacher in, in high school. That was dog the bounty, pure dog the bounty. Hunter. She would call us snakes. What? She'd be like, "Get in there, snake! Come on, snake!" Holy yeah, shit. She, she was the best. Speaking of heaters, oh, dog snake. the bounty hunters, ladies, tits are yeah enormous. Uh, she's dead. Yeah. Oh, she died. She died from what? Oh, man. Meat over the cartel. Send her head over on a turtle. <laughs> <laughs> dog was like, "Oh no." <laughs> No, <laughs> fuck. <laughs> Did she look like kind of just like him? Yes. Yeah. That's so hot. Yeah. The final lady exactly looks the like most him. like you and then have sex with her until she dies. Maybe the worst bad breath face <laughs> in history. Doug Banning Hunter's wife? Yeah. That, Why? Yeah. Wait, the what? For sure. Bad breath face. I got a, she I got had a bad breath face. Yeah, theory, you could see you could see bad breath on someone's face. Well, at that point, her tit sweat could be like in the zone of oh, the breath. God. So you wouldn't imagine really know. it. Tit sweat stinks. The Don't be smirched. Dog's beautiful. <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> that casket had springs on it. <laughs> <laughs> Shocks, dude. That's kind of bullshit. We don't seek out someone who looks like the most like us to that's, mate with, and then just fucking. It's just your sister. Yeah. <laughs> True. Well, non-related, obviously. It's just your sister. I think Maybe a lot of people do do that. something. To, what? I think a lot of people do do. Fine, that. People, there are yeah, couples yeah. where they they do look like they're. Yeah. Well, there's like a science where you you constantly look at yourself, and then you you know you, you see yourself as the standard of beauty. What the hell happened to me? <laughs> <laughs> What I, science I, is that? Yeah, 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 yeah. I was Dude. hoping to follow up. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Who told you that no, you I were? Saw. Somebody told you. No, you're right to think that. No, I think there's like a. There's Every like time a, you look in the mirror, you're like this is it. No, I mean there's a nor- I, I said I used the wrong words, but there's like a normalcy. The doctor, the doctor yeah. prescribed there's you. There's a normalcy to your angles and your look, so that when you see somebody that looks like you, you're like. If I see a woman I that looks repelled. like me, I go. <laughs> <laughs> it's like that uh, that Chappelle sketch that when the haters go back in time. And he's like, "Don't make fun of them, Buck Nasty. One of them could be a great great granddaddy." <laughs> he looks off and he sees somebody. He's like, <laughs> yeah, I have the opposite. If I see a woman who looks even remotely like me, I want to physically attack her. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I want to destroy her. Yeah. Dude, you know what you can don't I realize you can do in your car in road rage? If you're road raging with a woman, you're within your legal right from your car to go. Oh yeah. From your car. Uh, <laughs> don't <laughs> I may or may not have employed it today. I heard you road raging you were road raging against a black lady when we were on the I did. Yeah. I did. I road raged her. Yes. Well, well she was road raged. It rage was like me. an intense one. We really? Just, what she happened? road raged me. I was chilling. I was dude, chill zone, ten o'clock in the morning. It's like I'm at my zenith of chill. No, yeah. it was ten o'clock in the morning because I was, was I was on the phone with you. <laughs> <laughs> You've been getting up a little early every now and then, and yeah, I think it was. I was heading to work out. Okay, ten thirty workout. Bam. The uh, for a second I was like, oh fuck, dude, it could have been bullshit. But no, I was pulling up, and there was traffic on Gerard Avenue, just you know, like a little two lane street in Philly. And I go to pull up, and there's like a break in the traffic because I'm at a red light, ready to make a right. And like twenty feet behind me, there was like a lady. So I didn't have the light, but I was like, I have nothing but space, and I'm pulling into traffic. So I just pulled right in and stopped. Yeah, dude, she pulled behind me, fucking. Let off the loudest, most insane honk. Ugh. Just a big, fat, like, pissed off black lady. Just, <laughs> just fully shaking her fucking car, screaming out of her window. And I chilled for a minute and I stopped and I went, rolled my window down and went, shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> she went ballistic. Oh, of course. She dude. went ballistic, dude. <laughs> dude. <laughs> they treat. Then, yeah, then she, she kept telling I live. I don't care. I don't care. It's good that, I don't it's care. Good that at all. one got pulled back. <laughs> <laughs> they <laughs> no, no everybody treats Gerard like fucking Frogger they just it's don't stop crazy. Yeah. and there's yeah. not that many lights dude no. when I was in college I, I lived in, uh, in North Philly and two people there's like the older lady and then a younger dude were just sitting in the middle of the street like the turning lane mm. and as I went to turn she pushed this kid in front of like my car and his, oh, these are pedestrians yeah and it hooked the, the purse of this the younger one and they made a, a, another car made me pull over 
as if I hit this person. <laughs> they pull out like a siren and fucking. No, he like cut me off. He's like, you hit it. You hit it. Going fucking yeah, nuts. True. So I pull over and then I was, I just got out. I'm like, you okay? She dropped her purse. Right. And I'm like, are you okay? <laughs> I'm just and, passing and, through. And then I realized the kid's like mentally ill. So Ooh. the girl's like, yes. And then she go, the mom's like, she's not okay. She's not okay. And now I'm in this like, she's fine. She just said, and then she went, no. And they took my license plate. Like 30, 30 days later, I got a fucking, What'd you get? in the mail, I had to go to court. And they had to settle with my insurance company. They tried to get like 350 grand. They eventually what? settled out of court for like 1500 bucks. Frogger. All right. Oh my God. Like, this is a bitch. Like, we want 350,000. It's like, all right, we're going to give you a thousand. <laughs> deal. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah that's, it's a fucking deal. scam. Good deal. They just chill in the middle of the streets looking oh, for a payout. Oh, man. I fell for it. I was young and dumb, full of calm. Yeah, you could have. You know, <laughs> could, yeah, I just kid. kept moving. <laughs> yeah, I couldn't, dude. The, 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 <laughs> the, pe- the police, the people's police were out and about trying to, <laughs> they would have fucked me up. Yep, yep. Well, they, they might, you might have been in on the scam. You almost got you almost got WWE. Yeah. Cut, cut you almost that. got oh, yeah, yeah, the scam expert. Lemare. <laughs> Lemare. <laughs> ah. Come on, say it. <laughs> Seems like a no. I'll leave him be. Oh yeah. Well, I can tell when there's a no. He's scam. got a pa- you got a pack of scams? Yeah. Uh, he's he been got scammed, scammed, but I can I can tell when You have been scammed or are you doing scamming? He, he got, got scammed. scammed. Oh, we had Let's it. go. We've already talked about oh, it, but yeah. he, oh, was, yeah. he was, uh, we were in Milwaukee, got on Milwaukee, gone wild, <laughs> subreddit, <laughs> tried to, dude, tried to join an orgy. <laughs> they made, him, uh, they made him buy a ticket. He was like, I'm only going to give you half. Then he got to the Holiday Inn and or the Days Inn or wherever. It was a Holiday Inn in Milwaukee. And they were like, he was like, all right, I'm here. They were like, we're too busy fucking. We can't let you in. <laughs> <laughs> so he let her text him. Yeah, I know. I know. <laughs> how, much right you, how much you lose? Oh, shit. That's not too bad. You got that's a fun time well, for 100 bucks. Well, 100 bucks thinking you're about to come. Yeah. That's tough. It's, you know, it's what it's attached to. Yeah, but the emotional roller coaster ride's kind of fun, you know? Yeah, sure, that was a fun story. That, I, I was happy about it. Cheated for Your heart bucks. beats, and it's flopping at a level you, once you walk in that day's in. Yeah. You're getting psyched, dude. That's, That's worth a hundred bucks. Feel God. something in Milwaukee. There's nothing else to do. <laughs> <laughs> Lose a hundred bucks on That's a fake sex case scenario, year. honestly. Yeah. Yeah, you should have just jerked off to the idea of it happening. I'm sure he did. I'm sure, yeah. Exactly. I'm about yeah. to beat off, too. I've done, I've done that. I've shit. done that a couple of times. I've been on the pages and then just and then just uh, texted someone and they'll be like, I'll meet you right now. And yeah. I just jerk off and I go, All Yeah, right, the thrill's dude. already there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I ordered one in, in Montana and this rhino showed up and I was like, shut the door. I was like, <laughs> 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 I was like, I knew I should have done this, dude. Dude, be- beating off the hooker was backwards. Ads, it was beating fucking off the hooker ads is like the Harry Potter <laughs> portal just into like you're standing right at like like platform 33 and one <laughs> you're, you're, right there. Yeah. you're about to go through into another part of yes. life there is something <laughs> hot about like just reading like oh. the descriptions of like days who you in. could possibly order the Milwaukee's days in is uh getting ear support with a phone call is a very dangerous game as well but like, I don't know they're talking like nah, never mind <laughs> yeah. they'll get you they protect their own dude you gotta watch <laughs> this is the blue line. Yeah. <laughs> they back the blue. Yeah, I think I don't know. How do you think hookers are doing now? Do you think they're like thriving, or you think they're getting backpaged out of existence, or what? Like, it seems like they're doing pretty good. Yeah, I, I think they just start before. doing that. I follow them on Twitter. <laughs> yeah. No. Yeah. You follow backpage hookers on Twitter? Yeah. Well, they've been dispersed, dude. <laughs> I follow a couple. Why? I, I just want to see what they're up to. <laughs> you know what they're up to? They're fucking yeah, they're guys know, for but money. It's, pottery. it's interesting because they're always like they they just uh, they make me mad because they'll like they'll they tweet you stuff. You are a fucking serial killer. One hundred percent. Your sex workers make me <laughs> mad. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> no, I follow them on social mad. media. And they... <laughs> He's pissed. They're not fucking him. Good lord. No, not that mad. They just like they'll always they always be like, oh man, I tripped today. Can someone send me two hundred bucks? It'll be like that kind of stuff. Yeah, they're like alt comics. Yeah, 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 yeah exactly, <laughs> dude. And they're trying to put together a tour. <laughs> yeah, dude. Can, yes. Can my aunt send me two hundred dollars? Yes. They post yeah. dates. Or some guy that wants. To fuck me. Oh yeah, or a they post dates. Freak. They they post. They'll be like going to be. Their in whole things that they're trying to take advantage yeah. of the weak minded. They're like yeah. they're like pastors. <laughs> you know what I mean? Pastors are just selling this the fake story of Jesus to it's fucking. It's kind of true. 
to mentally ill people. <laughs> talking about the fake story. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Why, Even dude? if okay, let's get into it, dude. Even if it's Jesus is just a historical person, yeah. what a great imagine person. the fucking ripple effect he's had on the history of humanity. Yeah, it's Take great. away the transcendent element, dude. I'm just dude, it's more about the pastors. These I guys need to that. tone it down with all their goods. Yeah, those late night pastors. They gotta yeah. hide yeah. some yeah. money, dude. That's yeah, pretty, well, again, that's just wild. another. They're like hookers for religion. It's like exactly. That's, yeah, that was, yeah, that's fair. But yes. again, if you know, woe to them who fucking fall for such a thing. Yeah, <laughs> you see the them. dude in like Detroit that just no, got just, fucking. You think Jesus would protect? Dude, was showing up in like a Bentley and like <clears throat> diamond no. suits and shit, walking into some dog shit church in Detroit. <laughs> it's like, yeah. dude, these people are trying to eat dinner. Yeah, but every once in a while you start watching them and you, you start thinking <laughs> like, idea. could I do that? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> How, like how long would it take me to to rise the ranks? We had the, a friend in Philly whose dad was a pastor. You need charisma, dude. You need lots of charisma. Yeah, your you stage you. presence. <sighs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Not yeah. gonna do it. I've been watching the tape recently. Tommy, Tommy's, Tommy's got some it. stage presence. Yeah, yeah. Hitler, Hitler could have been a great pastor. Yeah, you know, he True. was. He was a great pastor, I guess. But he would have made a pretty poor rabbi, though. <laughs> <laughs> I got a hunch. <laughs> I'm go. sorry, dude. I, I haven't had a beer yet. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> no, so you hate good. these early casts. You hate the priestly class, huh? You hate the priestly class. I do. Yeah, Fair I got. Enough. I got real stickler about those motherfuckers these days. Gotcha. I guess just upbringing. I wasn't abused or anything, but just the whole. I'm bitter. About what? I don't get years that. Of Catholic school. I don't have it. Yeah, man. Other people do. Yeah. You're not the only one. There's Bill a couple Burr, guys Bill, I like. Bill Burr seemed to. He had some jokes that were like that. About the priests. About like growing up in that. Yeah. 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 It's not just a like, priest though. It's like I was pissed at my parents for a while. My for dad what? never went to church, but like he formulated like a, a system like where I, if you didn't go, you were like grounded and shit. Yeah. So, imagine what else you might have gotten into if you didn't go to church. You yeah. Dude, imagine been, like, having kids. Boys under you don't track. go to church. And you get to send your kids away for an hour and a half every Sunday. <sighs> yeah, it's great. Every Sunday, True. just like you guys go. Yeah. Or you're grounded. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> I'd have like three religions for my kids. Yeah. <laughs> How bought into it were you as a child? Oh, it's not, never. I never. was all in. I mean, in grade school. <laughs> I'm all in. Yeah. <laughs> I was all in grade <laughs> school. Were you? Yes. Yeah, I was Fully all in grade committed. School. Up to like seventh grade. <clears throat> yeah, that's normal. Yeah. Yeah, I was on my hands and knees doing prayers at night in fifth grade, I think. <laughs> why, hands and knees. Yeah, yeah. Uh, butt up. <laughs> butt up. <laughs> hey, hey, give me the Holy Spirit. Yeah. Maybe I'm figuring out why I'm pissed. <laughs> they fucking tricked me. You're just like kissing the guy through the confession screen. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, so, yeah, I feel indifferent. I remember being younger and being like, man, that's done. I brought up religion, dude. Uh, Shut who the cares? fuck up. Who cares? We religion bring, rules. We talk religion. <laughs> I love religion, dude. Are you a Buddhist or something like that now? I could see you being like. No, I never. I can never get like that into it because then you're just doing all these like rituals every day. And it's like I couldn't possibly yeah. sit down and like say words to my ancestors for real. You seem like a very spiritual dude, though. I do. I have a ritual I do in the morning where I blast cold water on myself and imagine <laughs> the like the unfathomable depths of space. <laughs> And I go, man, just dude, I should be happy to be alive. Yeah, I hit yeah. cold water on myself, and I go, and it hits me, and I go, one day all my particles will be out in <laughs> deep, dark, cold space, and I just go, I might as well take advantage of this now. <laughs> That's my ritual I do right now. <laughs> That's pretty good. That's like pretty zen. Tight. That's meditation. Yeah, pretty, I'm pretty zen, I guess. Yeah, I guess you could say. <laughs> but they all school up. All those things school up, and it turns into a fucking cold eventually and it's like stinky yeah you gotta it's 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 feels like it's easy to slip into the cultness of it yeah you know because it's so nice to believe in a higher power yeah yeah I, Dude, I, t I went to when I, I was in a uh, rhode island and I, I was driving home and i passed the vedanta society which is like a, it's like a sect of hinduism and i was like dude i want to go in there anymore. i've never passed a place like that i want to see what it was like so i got up at like 5 30 in the morning and went to like their morning service Dude, I th I used I sat on a fuck. It was Wait. so sick. <laughs> They're very this similar. This weekend you went to a Hindu service. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This weekend I got up at like five thirty, and I imagine went in not telling your friends that. that should be the first thing out of your mouth. hundred percent. Really? After I forgot all about it, dude. I went, dude. It went in. <laughs> it was fucking sick. It was only like six people. 
but I rolled in and it was just like two Holy dudes. Holy shit. They were probably like, all right, this is it. Yep. Here's the shooter. Here he is. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of people were in there? Vishnu. <laughs> He's, here. Yeah. Yeah. He's here. He's here. He's here. Gross. I am become yeah. death. He's yeah. FaceTiming. We, just, it was, we went and we just sat in silence live stream. for yeah. an He's hour. live streaming. That's We just good. sat on pillows on, a, on an altar for like an hour. The whole When I went in, I was like, oh shit, am I sitting in like the wrong spot? Because it just it's totally silent. Yeah. Then a lady like got up after an hour. Lady went <clears throat> and got up and hit a keyboard and was like, "Oh, these <laughs> new just chilled. I was like, "This is awesome." Nobody said hi to you or what are you doing here? No, they they welcome you. They're Did just they like, have What's to up? Come grab on an extra pillow or were they? No, there was one on there. Thank okay. God. Yeah. So yeah. So we just chilled and then it's like a Moroccan restaurant. Dude, it was nice, dude. So it you was, just sat like Indian style. Yeah. I, well, my knees started to hurt, so I can't. That's the thing too. It's totally silent. And I'd be like. <laughs> oh. and I kept trying to move my knees. Especially in the morning, oh. dude. In the morning, my stomach the whole time oh, was like, growling, just farting. Mine, yeah. <laughs> Mine was growling, but the lady was being really loud, which I was like, "Thank God," because she would do something loud, then I'd be like, <coughs> "Like move my legs." You got to time was, it with the, with the big bro. That's insane. You did this, dude. You hit the keyboard and insane. started. They just did this whole thing, and I was like sitting there, and a dude just slid me a book. He's like, "Here you go," and it's like pointed to the page. He's like, "We're right here." And I was like, "Thanks, brother." It was just me, like. But when I first went in there, I was nervous because I was like, I had my eyes closed, and I, I never seen these guys. I don't know these guys. I'm like these, I was like expecting them to clobber me. One dude just like beat my ass and be like, "We got him." Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The, I mean, was imagine, there... imagine your wife not thinking you're fucking somebody else. You're like, I'm just gonna go to a Hindu church at five thirty. Yeah. I'll be right back. You got nothing was, to bring home to prove that you didn't fuck somebody. I was yeah. laughing. It's it's like that meme. They think like you're thinking about other girls, and I was. I was in like a non dualist temple. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That is a great fucking way to, to start cheating on your on your spouse. Just like start this whole program where you're checking out new religions every, yeah. every early morning. Dude, I had I took I took the most challenging the, the farting thing reminder. I took the most challenging shit of my entire life recently. I was at Seventh Street Comedy Club and I like had to shit so bad. And it's a tiny little room. Mm. And the bathroom is like a thin door right next to the showroom. And I literally and and I had fuck. I had you explosive had <laughs> explosive oh like like I couldn't hold it. I tried to hold it for like yeah. forty five minutes. And and then, and then Aaron Berg was on time. stage. Aaron Berg was on stage and literally said, "It's like you can hear people shitting. That's how like small <laughs> this room is." <laughs> dude, dude, I literally, I was holding, it, I was holding an ass, and I was dude, no, like no, straight no, up Chris. Shawshank Redemption. Like I was, I was farting when he would get laughs. Like I was just, nice. and it was so painful. <laughs> dude, I took, can't tell who that came from. <laughs> 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 sound like Matt. We're all one being anyway. It doesn't matter. Dude, it, 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 We're all it, particles. He was on stage. <laughs> We're all particles. So what's the difference? <laughs> Guys, I can fart constantly. <laughs> We're all particles. Those are just particles. They're made out of stardust just like you. <laughs> that gas was destined to escape from Of me. course. <laughs> but someday you'll meet that gas again. <laughs> I mean, if the universe is infinite, eventually your particles yeah. will meet that fart again. So for sure. In the swirling, in the swirling cosmos. Better chance of meeting your grandma. Yeah. I'll just smell it one last time. <laughs> <laughs> so how did it end so up? Yeah. It took you got away with it, it? Yeah, yeah. I got away with it. Dude, I was freezing. Until some girl in fainted that. walking yeah. in there Dude, I was freezing like crazy. It took me this entire set to get the shit out. How was wow. the wipe? Clean. That's what's up. Surprise. Well, That's I nice. was I was letting it out just like there is something that happens before driven. shows where you you gotta you you rush the shit. Yeah. yeah. Like if I'm about to go on and I have to shit, you gotta rush it. Then you got a dirty ass. Ew. Yeah. Yeah. It yeah. happens. I started bringing a, that happens. they make they make tubs of Vaseline <laughs> yeah. for your lips. Then you take your pants off later and it smells. <laughs> oh god. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> no, Chris. <laughs> Good lord, not does. that dirty. I bet it does. Liquid Death's Mountain Water, flavored sparkling water and iced tea, may look like a tall boy can, Sweet. but it's a non alcoholic choice you can enjoy anywhere. I love a non alcoholic choice. With flavors like Rest in Peach and Armless Palmer. You can make any boring what about Zoom the Grim call. Leafer, dude. Grim Leafer is well, I think the Grim Don't forget the Grim Leafer. They didn't list the Grim Leafer. You can make any boring Zoom calls a little more exciting. I'm cracking open a can. Everybody's going to be like, you're fired. And go, guys, 
It's God. it's just a grim leafer. God, his arm was it's just an armless palmer. It's armless palmer. I'm not getting hammered. <laughs> Chill out, guys. Drinking liquid death, or if you're driving a bus too, how funny would that be? Yeah. Drinking liquid death is also great for the environment. They donate a portion of their profits from every can sold to help end plastic pollution. Why would you drink anything else? Pick up a can and start violently murdering process your thoughts today <laughs> <laughs> sex workers <laughs> just kidding your thirst <laughs> you can find liquid deaths healthy beverages on amazon or at a retailer near you plus matt and shane secret podcast listeners get 20 percent off their first no liquid way. death apparel purchases 20 percent off 20 percent off dude one fifth plus oh never mind i already read that available exclusively at liquiddeath.com slash drenched Exclusions may apply. That's liquiddeath.com slash drenched. Wow. It was. Let's get back to the show. Please. Let me ask you a question. You got it. And feel free to jump in on this one. Yeah. What if you could put all of your photos onto one gorgeous frame? Oh, I'd love it. You can. I can. With a connected frame from Aura. Shane, it was named the best digital photo frame by Wirecutter and The Strategist and featured in hundreds of gift, hundreds of gift guides. Aura frames are guaranteed to make mom or grandma smile. <laughs> I'd really like that because my grandma hasn't smiled in a while. My grandma has passed away. Same. <laughs> I could put one of those auras on her True. tombstone, which I've never visited once. <laughs> what you put pictures of? Ronnie Coleman. Me having fun. True. I'm alive. <laughs> <laughs> just to any other, anyone grieving, just be like, hey, what are you doing over there? Yeah, I'll say, no, like, I'll just, just kidding. Be, must be nice not suffering at all. <laughs> Hope you're having fun down there. <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> well, Shane, it takes just minutes to set up for years of enjoyment. What would you load on your frame? We already talked about that. Sports. Taunting our dead. Taunting ancestors. our dead relatives. Invite as many people as you want to add their photos to the frame. You never know what fun or embarrassing moments you'll get to relive. Oh, my God. <laughs> right now, Aura has a great deal for Mother's Day. Listeners can save on the perfect gift by visiting auraframes.com slash MSSP. That's A-U-R-A frames.com slash MSSP. Use code MSSP to get up to $30 off plus free shipping on their best-selling Carver frames. This deal ends on May 14th, so don't wait. Terms and conditions obviously apply. And Sean, you have something and to say. Sean has a show at The Stand. Yes, I do. I have, a show. I have a show at The Stand. It's May 3rd, which is when this is coming out this evening. If you're listening right oh, now, please yep. come. I'd really appreciate it. Thank you better you get so out. Much. You're going to get this out this evening? Uh, no, it's tomorrow. Tomorrow, okay. Yeah, yeah. So Wednesday, May Well, don't 3. be fucking around with the days like that, dude. I can't tell. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Yay! Matt, let's get back to the show where we're having a great time with we our friends, really Chris were. and Tommy. <laughs> Hi, guys. <laughs> Vaz is in my road kit now. They have these little tiny tubs. Ass? They have tiny tubs for chap lips. Yeah, my ass is, dude, first shit of the weekend, my ass is just in completely disarray. <laughs> have a little, a little. It's a tiny tub. Did you of give birth right? to your kids? <laughs> Why is it yeah. all fucked up? No, because like when I take you take a shit and then like you don't get to wipe properly, you go on stage, you do the whole gets night. Chapped. Yeah, it gets all fucking like blistery or whatever that is, man. If you don't wipe your ass right, dude, it it's just like shit just destroys yeah. your body. Yeah, I told you, don't you have I was, a do you have a, a squatty or a, a tushy? No, a I, I have a travel one, but I always forget it. But I take the trash can. But it's like once I'm in the club, I have to shit. What do you mean a travel one? You have a travel squatty potty. Yeah. They fold no, out. I meant oh, a no, bidet. I was talking a bidet. about a bidet. A travel bidet? No, no, no. Yeah, just a bidet at home. <laughs> they make you, like, one of clear those. The... It happens to me when I'm gone. I have a bidet. I, the line broke. I get a new one. But the, yeah, you uh, got to wet the toilet paper. You got to bring saying, some. I'm saying some wet on the wipes. road. True. Bring some. Well, that's the vas. Just fucking smear it with vas. Yeah, dude. Move on. I was putting aquifer on my butthole for a while. Aquifer. Why don't you just, aquifer? Yeah. Why don't you get just preparation H? Isn't that Vaseline? Isn't that the, it's proper? Yeah. Just for know. your butthole. Yeah, I thought that was like something Same different thing. though. Tomato, tomato. Yeah. Well, it's Vaseline to help hemorrhoids. It is or, much or pain. less shameful. The Vas Vaseline. Prep yeah. H feels yeah. You buy it's a bright yellow box. Yeah. You walk, <laughs> walk through the Walgreens. <laughs> yeah. And it's for your lips. It's tiny. It's like lip and tattoo. Everybody thinks Nobody it's for your knows. Lips. Yeah. Ooh, somebody's gonna use that. <laughs> True. Uh, your yeah, wife's you put, gonna be like, oh, nice. Yeah. Well, I told her to get it from my specifically for my butthole. <laughs> you like, said, stay away from that one. Oh yeah, I told oh, her I'm like man. these are yeah. mine. 
<laughs> have you have it's you wiped your butt and then put your finger back on the thing? I've made that mistake as a child. Yes, I've yeah. stank up some Vaseline. A couple <laughs> yeah. I've stanking up the family Vaseline a couple times, dude. <laughs> yeah. That sucks when you open it up and it's just like uh, <laughs> fucking groans in your face. Do you ever stank up the Vaseline? No. What oh, is dude, going on? Yeah. It holds no. the ass smell forever. Do you ever stank yeah, it up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, dude. It's, what do you mean? It's because you, you double chapped dip. ass. Yeah, you you go, I would go three fingers in that thing. You fuck and your uh, ass up. God. You grab you, you, dude. If you if your ass is Jesus. so gross that when you take your pants off it <laughs> no, smells like that shit, is so that's fucking never gross, happened, dude. But. That's a lie. Yeah, yeah, I swear it's never happened. All right, I believe you. I knew one guy who I take it back. I know when this boy lies. When I when I would. Uh, like, we, I was, why are you coming at his mussy like that? Dude? <laughs> it, we've, had this, we've had several disputes. <laughs> I used, when I was playing sports, though, if I was really exerting myself at the end of practice, I would like my fucking spandex or whatever would be like, I'd be like, this is, I definitely shit a little bit. Oh, wow. Whoa. You never like had marathon. that? I would think football, you'd be. You'd you would be, think. Yeah. No. No, I don't. I don't I've never shit myself, myself playing football. It was never. It's a hard to find shit. It, like, it like NFL pro players with. A little dung in their pants yeah. after. A big well, also hit. be going to the cafeteria, be basically just eating like buckets of Olean. Yeah, you know, it gives you anal well. leakage. <laughs> <laughs> Drexel cat food. Yeah, yeah. I can't believe that fucking cat scored that goal. <laughs> 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 it's crazy. Yeah. Goal! <laughs> <Damn>. Fuck. <laughs> that's, that's, yeah. Was that real? That's a tough one. Dude, it got me, man. It got me. Yeah. Got I me. We had a nice weekend. Lamizi was with me. Oh, yeah. We went to the Cassini. Oh, yeah. Parks. Yeah. How was a it? A couple of the birds showed up. That was pretty exciting. Nice. Yeah. Which ones? Uh, it was two tight ends, Stoll and Tyree, and then Jergens, the guard, and Ian Book, dude. Book. Damn. Got to hang out with Ian Book. Sick. Dude, nice. So excited. Yeah. Awesome. As soon as he walked in, I was like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Is he pretty embarrassing? Yes. Nice. He looks He's like he's cool. Did. did they stay at the casino or What's did they he, go? He's our yeah, third? We, stayed, we, get, we played blackjack. He's our third? Was fuck yeah. Yeah, I guess. Can he punt? He's second. He's probably second. See that punter we picked up? Sorry, this is going to be boring. No, yeah. no, no. no, no. It was a the draft was crazy. Who was it? <laughs> yeah, the, <laughs> yeah. What do they call him? The, uh, he's a and fucking Jaylen beast. Jalen Carter or something. Mm -hmm. Jalen Carter's a good one. We yeah. got the secondary of that of the school. We got Georgia. Georgia, Georgia. yeah. yeah, yeah. Right yeah. Yep. Dude, we're going to be dirty. <laughs> yeah. I'm the edge we're rushing. Dirty. Yeah. I'm following the news. Yeah. We got Georgia's fucking secondary. We got Georgia's defense. How about our running back, though? How about our fucking running back? Bro. What a Swift. DeAndre Swift coming back to Philly. Kind of nice. Yeah. He went to St. Joe's Prep. Did he? Yeah. Yeah, I know. He, my fucking high school he, went to, he went to Georgia. Yeah. Yeah. What the hell? How about that? Something's going on. It's going to be a good year, boys. Yeah. Something's going on. Yeah, you, we already almost Birds are looking good, dude. Birds are looking real good. How'd they get such good draft picks after <laughs> almost The king. Being, the god. So, Howie Roseman. Howie Roseman's been He's, a, he's the best in the business. He Bro. fleeces every fucking team. Didn't We're doing we well. Things are looking like up a billion for dollars, us. too? Yeah, yeah, that hurts. Yeah. That's going to hurt. Yeah, true. Who hurts? Yeah. But he doesn't we really start getting paid until late, right? In yeah, the they're going to have to in the next like three years. 50. Yeah. I mean, at that point, with that money, didn't you think like if they hurt their ACL, they would give them like a prosthetic? They would just like cut their leg in half and give them like a cybernetic knee? Yeah. Give them a blade. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> Why not? It's got to be, someone's got to be sneaking that in pretty yeah. soon. Yeah. Sooner or later, there's going to be an NFL player with blades, right? You know those are like twenty thousand dollars. Those blades. Wait, what kind of blades? That's it. About? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like the man. That thing costs an arm and a leg. <laughs> <laughs> when you say blade, <laughs> when you say blades, what do you mean? It's like that, a like spring. carbon Prosthetic fiber, leg. like spring. Oh, yeah. 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 Why, why not? Twenty thousand. I would have guessed three hundred thousand. Really. Yes, I thought it'd be like yeah, five. but if you're pricing the legs, leg, you can't also, price the legs. A lot of these people, are, their legs are falling off for <laughs> different reasons. They True. can't afford twenty thousand dollar spring. <laughs> yeah, spring yeah, no one's getting springs. <laughs> There's got to be a dude with diabetes who's like, yeah, give me the blade. Yes, yes. Getting banisters. <laughs> <laughs> banister, I would assume, costs twenty thousand dollars <laughs> for somebody to install a banister yeah, in your oak. leg. Yeah. yeah. Twenty thousand is not. Yeah. Just bringing a leg carpenter out here and measuring you up. Uh, but it's just you just. It's just he's a, off. He's off an inch. It's just, just a carbon fiber thing with a plunger on the top. Just, drunk on the job, <laughs> using the wrong size screw. Oh. 
<laughs> just using your uncle play your last those blades sport. have to be so expensive <laughs> dude i google sport can't be more than a motorcycle though blow the whistle on are they letting I these bet. dudes uh play with regular people like in the olympics and stuff i, I don't think so i think there was a big controversy there the was it men i think it almost yeah. happened well, i'll tell you what they're letting other people play where it's uh, not exactly very <laughs> exactly <laughs> dude you have some dude with blades was in long jump or triple jump, and he fucking smoked everybody. <laughs> yeah, yeah, really? yeah. yeah. I, I bet he wasn't even like an, yeah. an athlete. He's like, I could do something with yeah, How have I never heard first. about these blades? Well, you they, remember it, the Oscar Pistorius. Yeah, yeah, he was the first one. He was a sprinter from You'd be South surprised. Africa that had You'd be it. Yeah. And, and then he, he was, shot his wife. His wife yeah. misplaced really? one yeah. of his blades. Did she yeah. come out of his blades? She came out of the bathroom, and he was like, Where's my second yeah. blade? He said, Who's in there? Yeah. It better not. <laughs> oh, I hope it's not my wife. It was like the end of the Terminator. He's just like dragging himself along the. Yeah. Shot his wife in self defense. That's what he, he claimed. claimed. He claimed it was an accident, and I think got away with it. <laughs> no, he got. He got. Oh, yeah. yeah, he got. I'm pretty no, sure he's... she was like against the bathroom wall, like trying to get out the Damn, window. Did they confiscate <laughs> your blades, like when you're a drug dealer. They take <laughs> yeah. Your yeah. Yeah. yeah, you can't take your blades. We're confiscating to prison. your blades. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He shanks those things up. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> runs runs at you. <laughs> Dude, just flying away. Yeah. 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 The bicycle yeah. kick. Yeah. We were supposed to be double dragging. Yeah, dude. Luke Hang, dude. <laughs> dude, imagine like 50 years later, he's hobbling back to get his bag with like his suit jacket and his blades. I don't Damn. even use them anymore. Yeah, you could shawl shank right out of there, dude. Put a couple little shovels on there. And yeah. <laughs> Cops he's are trying fine, to chase dude. him. Don't take my BLADs, please. <laughs> Burn it up my wife. <laughs> I didn't know it was my wife. <coughs> Damn, dude. Yeah. Fuck. So it. sorry that happened to him. Yeah. So what happened in the parks? Oh, uh, yeah, shows? You would have liked it. We played... Yeah, the shows were fine. Um, played uh, poker. Me and Beezer. Last Sunday night. Dude, Beezer, Beezer at a card table is a problem. <laughs> He's a nightmare. Why? He just hawks shit to everybody at the table. Talks to the dealer. He's like, come on, give me a card. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> he loses every time. <laughs> I'm not saying I don't. I lose every time, too. We played poker. He, We found like a, a dollar or three dollar uh, blind mm -hmm. poker table. So it was as cheap as you can get. Yeah. These dudes are sitting there were the saddest dudes I've seen. Some of them were cool, but there was a couple that I was looking at like, God damn yeah this is dark they're playing like ten dollar hands of poker at three in the morning <laughs> yeah it's just like fuck <laughs> dudes would be like i'm all in and stand up and be like oh yeah it was crazy it was tough stuff dude, I was I like, you want to know how much money I, <laughs> 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 I was drunk i was like i don't give a fuck the casino just paid me more than fucking this. <laughs> dude i remember I'm i think house money yeah. i think the first time i did Literally. a casino was with you in do we go where was it in central pa somewhere and i was like this is gonna be Probably sick dude we're going to a casino yep. casino sucks you thought the ladies <laughs> would have come out in front of you like dude no it's uh, yeah, it so sad casinos this... are disgusting yeah yeah and sad and if you drink... we had the buffet ticket it takes them that was nice. 35 Buffet minutes to bring nice. you a free drink when you're losing $200 takes, takes an hour. It takes so long. It's <laughs> insane, dude. They wouldn't let us drink. And then, what, what's that? They wouldn't let us drink at the casino. What? What do you mean? The casino? I, you keep saying the casino. Sorry I was just that angry at you, but I've been dealing with this guy all weekend. Yeah. He says, he the way he just, he's like the skinny guy with the mustache. I'm like, I don't know. You got to help more than that. Where? In what capacity? What are we talking about? He's like, we got done seeing a movie. He was like, was that the deaf guy in the movie that won the awards? <laughs> And then he stopped. He goes, no, he talked. <laughs> and I was like, what, what do you mean? <laughs> and then he doesn't, he doesn't say, he just repeats it. He goes, the deaf guy in the movie that won the award. <laughs> no, he talked. <laughs> I don't know what, what the question is. Where, where, where couldn't you drink? Oh. At the casino, every... Oh my God! <laughs> he, said barring, he said they were barring performers from, allowing, from drinking before they performed. Oh. We had to buy our own drinks. Yeah, yeah, that's what it was. Oh, they they didn't stock the they didn't stock the green. They wasn't going to drink more than one beer. Like the guy said that, which what? it never came to fruition at all. One what he beer said, per hour is before. Remember when he said that he was like fair. the guy before we go on? He's like, yeah, you're not allowed. You're allowed to have two drinks an hour in this casino. And oh, everybody. Yeah, that's what. And I we were like, where? And he was like, casino, casino rule. 
immediately we went to Chicken and Pete's and drank <laughs> fucking <laughs> 10 beers in an hour. <laughs> it's like, what is this guy talking about? Does he mean from the service? I, I don't know. He, and also, yeah, why, I guess. They held your fridge back? Your personal green room fridge? Yeah, there was nothing. Get the fuck out of here. And then they were like, if you want drinks, you can buy them. And it was like, all right. That's yeah. kind of weird. Yeah, yeah. Casinos are fucking And then a nuts. bunch of people that I knew were there, so they all came back to the green room, and they were like, security's all over this. The fire marshal's furious. You're not allowed <laughs> to have this many people back here. It was like... Shut the fuck up. Okay. Yeah, I feel like there's what there's the that... Fuck? Yeah, it was, it was an aggressive... The guy walked in immediately. He was like, you got a lot of guy fans, huh? A lot of guys in the audience. Whoa. It's like... Yeah, that's good. Yeah, yeah. You get yeah, a whole, you get okay. a whole stadium of girls. Your, your comedy those guys. sucks. It's like, are you? <laughs> there's those guys. <laughs> Nothing truer. <laughs> They've been like living in their parents' Dude, basement for a long somebody? time, and they finally get a job, no. and then it's like, it, they look, it's like they join the Marines. The who? <laughs> I feel like those guys. You know, Shane's fans are the guys. No, who are, no, the guy, the guy, like the guy managing that backstage area is like someone oh, who's yeah. just like. This is the first job I feel like he's had in a while. I couldn't like, yeah, he's I was like, like fully I, committed. I, I yeah, like that. yeah, yeah. I was like, I wonder if they've had how new this is. Yeah, yeah. Have they not have a performer that drinks? Yeah, yeah. Sticks is there in a week, dude. They better <laughs> get ready. <laughs> yeah. True. They're just toll booth operators with something to prove. You know, they got nothing else in their life. So, like, this is my fucking time to shine. I'm going to be the sheriff for this green room. I'm going to ruin someone's fucking day. Yeah. Could I'm going to yeah. hold like back that. a Coors Light. They're jerks. <laughs> yeah, they're measuring your beer, being like, well, you're down. Yeah, yeah. Down there, is that yeah. your first still? <laughs> yeah, there was a I'll fridge. There was a fridge in the green room with like sodas and waters. So when people came back Gay. and started drinking it, and he was like, "Those sodas and waters are for the staff." Oh my! No, I was like, dude, dickhead. I see two people drinking a diet coke. Fuck off, man! That's I crazy. just sold this out twice. Can we have say, two dude. diet cokes? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I sold nine million dollars yeah, worth of beer. Yeah, yeah. I just built you another parking yeah. garage. Fuck face. Get me yeah, a beer. Was, you would think they'd be yeah. They they indulge everybody's things too. Dude, it's like that's how it was in Long like, Island, man. Gracious. Yeah. The fucking Paramount, the owner of the oh, Paramount. Yeah, that was yeah, awesome. This guy, guy rolled out the carpet. Yeah, that guy really? was perfect. Oh my yeah. god, he was he was making his handmade cocktails himself. And yeah, making us. We had lamb chops and after you, each you were show. Rhode Island. Paramount yeah. in Long, Long Island. Island. Long yeah. Island, Long Island. Yeah, this dude. guy was the best. He was the fucking man. That's awesome. Yeah. And a little speakeasy. So after the show, just like a private group of us sit down and have a dinner, like a king's table. Yeah. yeah. Bring out sick. even uh, lamb bat. lollipops yeah. and all you could drink. Fuck parks is what I'm saying. <laughs> I could get into a yeah, guy fuck like parks, nine Andrew, meters. Fuck. Yeah, 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 fuck. I could get into like they're like a handler. They're like no Coca Colas, and you're like, thank you, sir. I, I, that was but the one that having security follow me around the entire time was nice. Yeah, <laughs> there was one guy that was it was a bodyguard the whole time. Oh, that's kind of nice. And he was like, no picture because people would ask for pictures. He'd be like, no pictures. <laughs> and I'd be like, dude, they get pictures. And he was like, I got you. Don't worry. <laughs> he was like, I'll be the dick. You can fucking. Yeah, I was like, you don't have to be the dick. Good cop, dude. bad cop. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I'll be the dick. You be the ball. He was the man. So <laughs> yeah. No, that guy was fucking awesome though. The I'll, poker guys were, they were very scared of me. Really? Because I had a bodyguard standing, Ooh. and they were like, we were wondering who security was for, dude. And then you were like they, six dollars. They all thought in. it was for Beezer. <laughs> they thought security from the casino was like. About we gotta keep an eye on this guy. <laughs> he was like a Polish diplomat. Yeah. Dude, Beezer was so funny. Dude. He'd be like, he'd call dudes, and these dudes were taking it so serious. He'd be like, I don't think you have it. <laughs> <laughs> they, they'd flip over a fucking full house. He'd be like, <laughs> damn it. <laughs> I don't think you have it. <laughs> I, and we, I never played poker. I know. I never played poker like that. Yeah. Like well, also, real, neither has he. Yeah. I guarantee it. Yeah. So, so it to was be like, using that language, you got to put chips in, like for the blinds in the beginning. But it's like three dollars. You're like, I'll have his fives. They're like, just throw it in. <laughs> we'll give you the change. It's like, all right, I've Jesus, never played, man. I'm yeah, trying. Yeah. I think they were mad more because Beezer was there before me for like an hour. Oh. Sowing seeds of just, <laughs> they hated oh, us. Oh, you took my car. <laughs> yeah, they hated us. You took my car. You yeah. took my fucking car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Beezer, Beezer would be like straight. They'd be like, no, that's not a straight. <laughs> be like, what? damn it, I thought I had that straight. <laughs> what, was it Hold'em? Did they yeah, have three cards? Oh, okay. Yeah, it was easy. It, I knew how to play Hold'em, but like. Uh, oh, my God. How tempting was it to six security on Beezer? <laughs> I couldn't do that to the sweet bees. What about just? <laughs> I did. I do get. I get. I recognize it's a shitty thing I do where I turn on bees. Mm. In those situations, I'm like, bees, shut the fuck up, dude. <laughs> yeah. And he's like, what, oh, dude? <laughs> Gives a fuck. I'm like, all right, you're right. <laughs> but you're being annoying to these 
retarded guys. <laughs> <laughs> no, he can be tough. He can be tough in a lift. He gets drunk. He gets in a lift. It's that exact attitude. Yeah. He does that in the casino. Yeah, it's tough. Where he'll get drunk in the lift and be like, "How do you drive this thing? <laughs> yeah. Turn up the tunes, <laughs> <laughs> T-bone." <laughs> but then when that tenth Adderall hits, yeah, he, he gets rowdy. Lemare's <laughs> Lemare's family came. Jabri and his mom came. Nice. Got to meet nice. Lemare's mom. That's nice. Awesome. How many beers did she have? None. You guys, you guys smoked a blunt though. That you smoked a blunt, Ma. That's yeah, nice. Yeah. <laughs> Am I allowed to say that? Yeah. All right. <laughs> yeah, that was fun. What was the grub sitch? Grub sitch was was actually nice. They did hook us up with the grub. Lamizu getting greedy with the grub, dude. <laughs> really? I've never seen. He was ordering. He was hitting the rich, rich Voss. He would order a meal at the club and one to go. Oh. <laughs> and he carried. When he, did you bring those wings all the way back to Philly? Yeah. <laughs> Come he, on, man. He ordered wings after the show. The show was at 7 30. Mm -hmm. We stayed at the casino. You left at like 1? Yeah. He's been carrying wings with him the entire time. Oh, my God. All the way back to Philly, all the way back to Helium in Philly on oh Sunday night. Did you oh eat him? God. Did you eat him at Helium? Yeah, bring him in the car. <laughs> nice. <laughs> <laughs> Jabri oh, was awesome. <laughs> Hanging with Jabri is a treat. God it's two Lemaires. Yeah. yeah that's, it's two Lemaires. And damn. they're both doing the same thing. Like the waiter will come over and they'll be like, um, I would like, um, <laughs> um, <laughs> sorry, I ordered like that earlier. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> oh like, my it's God. okay. You're fine. God, that's awesome. <laughs> yeah, a, that is a treat. <laughs> yeah, it was a fun weekend. I was so sad, though. Well, you're in the Cassini. Yeah, yeah, I was sad. The epicenter of sadness. It was raining out. It was sad, dude. Was there something else at play? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Chris, let's get into it. <laughs> is there something else there you something? know about? <laughs> <laughs> Tell him. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> yeah. Who are you with in San Diego? Uh, Matt yeah, and Nate around. Marshall. Nice. I'll and be some, in LA. Maybe I'll come cool, down. Really? Yeah. yeah. Nice. Oh, you got to come down. Nice. It's only like a two hour drive, right? I'll tell you, there's, all, yeah. there's a top secret awesome person coming on Friday. Let's go. Ooh. I'm very excited. That's fucking sweet. I'm so gay for this person. Yes. yes. <laughs> I'll guess. Um, and of course, the teams, dude. The teams are coming. Tier one operators. The tier dude. one operators, the community wants to show us around. Oh, they want to show us around Coronado. Oh, please. They want to show us where the steels operate. I'm wow. almost nervous to go. Give me the obstacle. I want to just give me the <laughs> obstacle like, dude, course. Do one push up. I'm like, no, <laughs> don't. I want to run the obstacle course. I'm going to go sit yeah. in the ocean. Let's yeah. hold. Let's hold a log and run true. in the ocean. True. Hold the yeah. Hold the boat. I think yeah. it's a boat, boat or a log. They it's do like both. 45 degrees. I'll tell you what. That yeah. salt water starts to burn on your oh, skin. Dude. It gets in your eyes. Oh, I read yeah. Goggins' book. Your dude, nookies are going to go straight in your ass. It's very cold to stay in there for like. Yeah, but I feel seconds. like I would dominate my like superior after a while. He would see my work ethic. He would see you. <laughs> he would go, You'd be like American Sniper. They'd call you old man at first. Yeah. <laughs> going through, you're like old. You're too old to go through training. What are you doing here? And then they quickly realize dude. you're the American Sniper. <laughs> <laughs> Maddie's got a flipper, dude. He's fucking. He's an Aquaman. Remember him? Shane's a good I'm swimmer. A I fucking suck. Aquaman. No, no. <laughs> Matt can't swim the dude, same as life. I no. love to swim, but my I'm very actually slow. Underwater, Maybe just because you were on that skimboard and then shallow. Uh, oh, nasty. no. Yeah. Skimboarding. He's nasty. He's nasty. He can shred gnar. Skimboarding. Like, <laughs> swimming, I'm, I'm like a fuck. I'm like Geo, dude, in the pool, dude. I'm yeah, funny. but that's good for Navy SEAL stuff. True. Being able to shred where the water meets the land. Oh, yeah. I'm you could be a good operator. I'm, I'm amphibious. You're an amphibian. I'm amphibious. Yes. Yeah. I'm amphibious. <laughs> you might be a frog man, dude. <laughs> I'm a frog man, dude. <laughs> I am going to pay. No, I'm, not gonna, I'm gonna tell the Navy SEALs. I'm going to be like, dude, pump up Matt. Be like, dude, you remind me of a seal. <laughs> I mean, you would seriously be like, yeah. You could tell me yeah, that now, and they'll yeah. say it to me, and I'll still yeah. go, yeah, I know. Definitely. Yeah. <laughs> He's got the operator. There's style. no breaking that part of my psyche. It's completely it. intact, and it won't break. That was one of my favorite arguments. <laughs> that, was, that was for real, like my favorite argument. We were at Helium one night after a show, and Matt was like, I could have been a fucking sick soldier. I'd be like, I was like dude, no, you couldn't. <laughs> dude, I, I would wonder my bell. identity just got lobotomized. It was so good to just be like, like, yeah, I guess if I did wake up every day at four and work out, I could have been a Navy SEAL. <laughs> For 12 years. <laughs> For, I was like, dude, <laughs> you and me live together. <laughs> you can't. <laughs> you whack off on an air mattress. 
I couldn't have like I couldn't deal with the structure of a job. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's my whole argument. I was like, you and me are losers. I would read the tone of an email and be like, I don't fucking like this. I'm out of here, dude. Yeah. Fuck this. Dude, I get emails constantly and I can't read them. <laughs> Yeah. It's like my money managers that are like, here's what we need. Here's your investment yeah. portfolio. And I'm like, I'm not, I'm never going to read this. <laughs> I'll sign it. But do you have to read emails as a Navy SEAL? For sure. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I doubt it. I, I, there's a dream dying for me no, right but now. I'm too. telling you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you. You're going to see that. They're going to ring that bell. <laughs> Dude, I would oh, ring it. Shit. Some guy's going to. I'd be gonna holding be... the bell. <laughs> I'm beating everybody to it. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck uh, that. Yeah, be tough. That's a tough life. You got to be wired different. You're just a you're a crazy person. Yeah, yeah. I can't wait to come back with some messaging on these guys. Like, there's no way they're gonna be normal dudes. I've hung out with them before. Are they good yes. normal dudes? You hung out yeah. with uh, one of them in L.A. Yeah, at the Chargers game. Ah, oh, there was yeah. seven yeah. hot hunks in there. Yeah, there were some hunks. Oh, he yeah. was the short guy, right? Yeah, the short yeah. guy was a seal. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, he was a great guy. He's the man. I right, stand corrected. He's not gonna be there though, unfortunately. The Bosa? He's deployed. Bosa's not going to be there. Bosa, I wish. Yeah, he's the man. Yeah. Yeah, Dago's going to be nice. It's going to be awesome. Might get tatted. <laughs> Did you ever see Wes Watson's tat? Dude, we should definitely both get Frogman tattoos. Dude, I, <laughs> Although, I think that's actually a yeah. Yeah. thing. Yeah, that's, the, like yeah, that's my yeah, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I don't mean to disrespect the teams yeah. on that one. It's like getting a gang joshing. tattoo and you're not yeah. in it. Yeah. I know you're joshing. They better know. Yeah, little Josh. ones on our ankles. If I might be support. on stage and see a couple red dots. Back it down. Cover me. <laughs> it's time to show our skills, Matt. For real. <laughs> For real. Could you carry to how many of us? All right. <laughs> Lazy let's say, let's, say, let's say there's a building. Yeah. How many of us in the building do you think it would? One team of Navy SEALs. So, like, let's say five guys trying to clear out a building. How many of us would it take to get them? <laughs> You're saying to stop five Navy SEALs? Yeah. Do they have you and me Are we both, armed or are they armed? We get guns. Are we, we, we have the same guns as SEALs? We have the same kit, basically? We, do I have yeah. the bombardier package? Nobody do teaches us how to use anything. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> Is, what's the numbers? Is it five on five? Or no, like, I'm saying how many of us. So, like, just replicants? could they clear out a hundred yeah. of us? we just be Probably. like the Taliban. Yeah, so that's what just, I mean. you would need a I just imagine them coming up the stairs being like, Sponge. Yeah. <laughs> Sponge. <laughs> Dude, the guy, who, the guy who pops his head out is great. <laughs> we would need an overwhelming force. Dude, that would be a really. We need the World War Z then. We need cannon fodder. Yeah, well, you would we need, need lots 10, of cannon fodder <laughs> to try to run at them. Dude, a movie Prove called. Prove your loyalty to this podcast. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> True. <laughs> <laughs> the dogs are the seals. <laughs> I think the dogs get wiped. Dude, a comedy? I think the squad gets wiped. Dude. <laughs> a comedy about that? You'd be, on, you'd be on a horse with a little scope, like, <laughs> not looking good. Yeah. <laughs> Richard! We, we, we would fuck them up in the comments. So, <laughs> even if they won, we'd be like, dude, they were so fucking gay. You see how gay they were? <laughs> Damn it. How many Lemare and Jabris versus the, the team? Lemare, you probably think. If I if I know one guy with confidence through the roof, it's Lemizi. <laughs> He's very athletic, though. Yeah, they're athletic and they're yeah, thick boys. You don't. Get it. Yeah. Start this. <laughs> you throw the guns yeah. in. If you just human shield dude. the first two, the second two might yeah, now, if you're them. talking hand to hand combat, that's a different story. Those guys get overhyped to hand to hand. Oh yeah. I'm one strike white dog <laughs> jitsu. <laughs> <laughs> That was actually just a take from uh, Chael Sonnen has a podcast. Yeah. I watched it, dude. He, he's funny as fuck. He's nuts, dude. Yeah. He's so funny. He attacked Huberman. Really? He calls him Huberman. Good. He attacked him, dude. Good. Like, flamed him. You're tip of the spear on the Huberman war. <laughs> like, like, I thought it was funny. Like, it WHO Huberman. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He calls yeah. him Huberman. I mean, dude, I yeah, I have nothing against the guy. It's just, it's fu it is funny to make fun of him. It's funny thing. to make fun of a science guy. Yes. And then, Obviously, it's a tale as old as time. Yeah, it's, yeah, yeah, of it's the funniest guy to make fun of is the guy who's talking about science. Especially goes, when yeah, they right. shed their skin and get, like, jacked. <laughs> Good one, dork. <laughs> <laughs> Well, now that they're using like fucking steroids and shit, it's kind of like throwing it it's off. Hilarious, dude. Talking like dude, Jack Science guys. Acetylcholamine receptors. <laughs> <laughs> like, dude. Yeah. Let me see the back of your boxers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. When I hear big words like that, 
I go straight to the back Imagine, of those jockeys. For real. For real. Imagine someone kneeling behind you. <laughs> Tabletop and them. them. Yeah. yeah. Like, let, let me see your solar plantars, how they fit on there. <laughs> <laughs> dude, get, get you would rock us, dude. He's huge. <laughs> I know. Getting pants and table topped in gray schools. Oh, bro. You gotta change neighborhoods. Oh. <laughs> it's over. I have a vivid memory. We got someone with it. We're still boys to this day. Talking penis yeah. out? Or yeah. Penis out. out. Yo, penis out table yo, top. It was gym day, brother. It was yeah. gym day, brother. <laughs> Easy to get down. <laughs> there could be a boner in there, too. You got it. <laughs> it was a tough time. Gym class? <laughs> There's nowhere to hide that boner. It's not like those nice pleated khakis. I told you, I used to display yeah, when I was younger. You when I was in grade school, I'd get a boner and stand up, and just, I thought it was funny to like stand up, well, show bone, in sweatpants. Right. Obviously, you were right. Yeah, show bone. Funny. That was like I've said it before. We convinced this kid that he, in order to be in our club, he Can had to get, go like, get get a boner, walk to get tissues, and stand in front of the class. <laughs> as soon as he was up there, we're like, "Yo, what are you doing, dude?" <laughs> Scott has like, a boner. <laughs> <laughs> we would get boners and like flash, we're like, "What's good?" My cousin would be like, "Nice." I'm like, "Yeah, yeah. check it out." We, we, only like, had, we only had. Uh... <laughs> what the fuck? We used to do the, we used to do the wiggle. What? Yeah, you get a boner and tuck it low, and then go, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> exactly. Pull the string. Yeah. 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 Usually show your boys like I'm boned up right now in yeah. class. Damn, like, I never pulled the out. string. That's a yeah, good way yeah, to do it. I only just went with the wiggle. <laughs> yeah. I know you, could. you can be like, yo, magic. <laughs> Look at this magic I'm doing. I'm gonna continue to do that now. <laughs> oh, Can't wait yeah. to do that. Oh. Now I just gotta get hard. <laughs> First time in weeks. <laughs> uh, I was in the audio. I was in the audio. You're in, in the audio point? Rhode Island, yeah. Really? I thought you were off the. I'm off. No visual point. No, That's my to thing. I I don't want to go for what I do traditionally is I just like push myself unnecessarily just to prove that I can do. It. I, I'm looking for a functional solution. That's the teams in you. That's no, yeah, true. You push yourself. You break yourself. <laughs> true. That's what I'm trying. You basically break. goggins. I mean, base you can't hurt me, dude. You can't hurt me, dude. Fuck you. <laughs> so I've been trying to find a healthy medium, dude. Don't go too extremist. Either I'm like on the porn, sick on the porn, or I try to do like. I can't deny my sexual energy. I don't think that's healthy either. So the audio has been a healthy medium. I'm serious, dude. No, I agree I with that. I know serious. So am I. I agree with it. I went, God damn it. I agree with it. can't deny my sexual energy. You can't, dude. I've tried. Yeah, dude, just whack off. off. Release your sexual yeah, energy. Then I'll start doing it when I'm not even horny. That's the problem. Then yeah. it becomes a thing. And it's a fun nighttime treat. You go, oh, shit, I didn't whack off today. I'm going to whack off before That's bed. That's the problem. There's, that day never comes where I didn't whack off. Oh. <laughs> yeah. I'll hit like three and be like, oh, yeah, nice. I'll never hit. Yeah, dude, I'll, I'll beat like, the energy right out of me. Oh, yeah. dude. Three, but, five. And then just you take like a day off. No days off, brother. I'm gonna, so wait, do you do seal, audio seal. every day? No, no. Moderations only only when needed. So I, I get to where needed and then I give myself a boost. So I Damn. was doing it. Well, the whole moral of the story was, is I was holding it all in, and then I'd have sex with my wife, and dude, and I would. Yeah, that's still fun. Yeah, yeah that I'm is. Gonna fun. Pop, I'm gonna pop. Yeah, but I finally got one where I was able to like hang for like. Damn, are you throwing Verlanders? The what? Just the ropes. Long ropes. Of seen seen of my rope was lacking because I was on the audio all weekend. My rope wasn't crazy, but yeah, when I'm like full, when the Kundalini, <laughs> when the Kundalini serpent's fully contained in the basket. Dude, the ropes are like they're gross, dude. <laughs> <laughs> The oh, yes, yeah, the so Kundalini gross. serpents <laughs> fully contained. I'll now release my sexual energy on my wife. <laughs> Holy fuck, Jesus. dude. Yeah. You're fucking nuts. I'm telling you, dude. I found a happy medium. I was always wondering I, why I believe you. people compare these two on like oh, yeah. our oh. podcast. Like It sounds just like Matt. No, Matt's... There's a difference. I don't know, man. It's the same plane. I know what you're talking it's about. A, it's it's yeah, the you guys same plane of saying universe. something insane and yeah. looking around like, what? <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. Now I get it. But his is much His is much more. This is just raw. <laughs> yeah. This is just yeah. a raw, insane person. He's, go, he's coming from a book of choice. Yes. <laughs> it's matter of spirit. You don't, feel like my, you don't feel like it's curated? You? Yeah. No. <laughs> Don't listen to them, dude. They're breaking your spirit. <laughs> There's nothing we can do yeah. to stop his spirit. <laughs> True. We've had talks. <laughs> There's I'm nothing going deeper do. in. Yeah, you have to. I know. Dude. <laughs> I'm already looking up a secondary podcast. So it's for your <laughs> I'm falling. Sur your suicide. <laughs> yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm right here. You're not gonna kill yourself from the ashes. Nah, nah, he won't. You promise? Yeah, for now. Yeah. 
Ten it year could deal. get there. Ten yeah, year yeah, deal. You have to read. You're a pessimist. You have to read Schopenhauer. No, I'm an optimist. Oh, nice. <laughs> yeah, that's what's up about everyone else. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Of course something good happened to them. <laughs> I knew things were going to go well for them. I'm telling you, you have to read, O'Connor, you have to read Schopenhauer. Yeah. He lays out a cogent argument against killing yourself. He's like, obviously it's a rational solution to all your problems because you're not doing, it's not doing anything. Because that urge that yeah. tortured you just lives on in everybody else forever and ever. Yeah. I'm more just like, well, I mean, why do that? Because then you're just not doing anything. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Yeah, might as well hang around. Yeah. That's sh- that's show fun, dude. Shope's yeah, you might as well hang fun. out. Yeah, yeah. That's Shope's thing. Shope's like obviously pain. nothing wrong with it, but also like, dude, don't be fooled. Thinking it would be not like to instead of kill yourself, just meth storm. That's what yeah, I said. You gotta, yeah. Fuck it, dude. Yeah. That's what I said. Let's dude. go down to Arkansas, get yeah. a shitty trailer. Dude, if you don't care yeah, about your life, you don't care. Yeah, sexualizing mm-hmm. the need for meth. You know what I mean? So what? Like you gotta start to sucking dick and stuff. If you go. Oh, hold on, heroin. You, you know suck for heroin. People suck dick for heroin. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. There's two very dangerous drugs. Whereas if you just play the cocaine route, you can just. Yeah, we're talking about guys explode. on the brink of a blitter, like a, of like total dick obliteration. For coke. True. We're saying if you're ready to kill yourself, why not just turn your life into an absolutely yeah, I know. dangerous Shit amusement park? show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So where where did sucking dudes' dicks for meth come into the equation? Because if I the mean, meth, <laughs> <laughs> I was saying say do meth. He was saying that could lead to sucking dick. Yeah, yeah, perfect. But you're also <laughs> you're gonna, you, kill, you're gonna kill yourself. So yeah. Yeah. so you kill yourself right before the first dick you suck. And I think meth you, you kill yourself suck while dick. the dick's in there. Blow, his, oh, it's blow nice. his dick off too. And the jaw locks like a pit bull. Throat, oh. throat him. <laughs> yeah. And shoot yourself in the throat. I feel like you would just beast up on meth. You wouldn't be sucking dicks. You'd probably just try to like rob a bank unsuccessfully. Like yeah. Just rob a bank would be sick. I would try yeah. to travel the world and just disappear and then die and no one would know. They wouldn't be able to trace yeah, me back. Yeah, you say that. But if you're depressed, you're not going to arrange a trip. Mm. Dude, a big one. That's where the meth comes in. true. Paying for. That's where the meth comes in. Paying for lessons for one of those wingsuits. Asking Ooh. Shane for fifty thousand dollars for a helicopter ride. <laughs> Go up to the like the Swiss Alps. You ever see these videos, dude? Where yeah. they're like dodging trees by like a foot no. right into a bridge. And it comes out and they just go for they go for like an hour. It's nuts. Damn. They yeah, they you, float forever. You could fly, yeah. And you could fly into during that awesome. time you have a decision. Yeah. yeah. You got a decision. Should I just fucking buck into a mountain or let this ride right to the ground? Or you could pull a shoot. I'll do it next week. I'll do it next week. Yeah. You're gonna have a hell of a time. Then one day Searching you see a guy death. in a fucking hang glider and you're like, there he is. <laughs> <laughs> this is hilarious. <laughs> Just grab onto yeah, him. Yeah. No, Dude, there's a, there's no, a, no, no. I don't care if I live or if I die. <laughs> you grab me like. <laughs> <laughs> there's, a, uh, there's a video of two, two wingsuit dudes that one guy has to go over like the Golden State Bridge and one dude is supposed to go under and his whole family, their families are like on the bridge. <laughs> one guy successfully goes on the... The guy on the top just caught like a, a wind or something. Bro, just, just boom, right into the fucking side. Yeah. His whole family just watched him float down to the oh. ground. Yeah, that's... So there's other options. Yeah, speedboat speed accident. Those are pretty fun. Speedboat like ramp, at least. Like the fast ones that flip up. Yeah, flip up and yeah. the guys skip along the water for a while. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if you're going to go. Yeah, but also I think there's an aspect of it that's like they're just sick of excruciating mental pains. So or like, do something physically painful. They're like, brother, I don't want to do that Yeah, either. for sure. If we're talking honestly. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. That's why you got to yeah. take the drugs. Yeah. Take the drugs. Just do heroin. Block the, yeah. And then jump out of a plane. And then, yeah. And then fall out of a two-story building and break your legs. <laughs> <laughs> there was a priest you know, this in like. This is it. I'm going to jump. The priest in like Spain or something. Mm-hmm. Attached himself to like 50,000 helium balloons. Yeah, I saw that. <laughs> what? He was in Brazil or yeah. Brazil or something. Yeah, yeah. maybe he it was up? Argentina. Did his I wife forget. just die or something? No, he was trying to raise money. <laughs> Bro. Is he up? He up. <laughs> he absolutely up. <upped. laughs> yeah. He was trying to raise money, but he was also like a parachutist and like trained. He thought something was gonna happen as they he gets to a certain elevation. I think if they he start they popping, pop. he could dislocate, you oh. know, disengage, and then take a parachute down. Dude, they don't. They go up pretty fucking high. Yeah, I don't yeah. know. Yeah. So he found just, his remains at ex- sea. Yeah, they. Ex- <laughs> he died. Yeah, oh, he yeah. just suffocated at altitude. I don't know. He probably did. Yeah, he probably yeah. went too high. He had a, and lost a parachute. He could have just jumped. Maybe he could have blocked. I think he hit the fucking. I'm out of here. Yeah, that's <laughs> what he tried to get the heavy. He tried to take the shortcut. Yeah, he's probably up there like I could unbuckle this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> up music playing. <laughs> yeah, going up as high as the opposite of jumping over the bridge. 
just fucking going up as high as possible. That's scary. That's kind of that's definitely a good way to go and just slowly go as high as you can. Slowly yeah. asphyxiate like yeah, yeah. With less and yeah, less. Yeah, you could do like the you, fucking Red Bull guy that jumped out as high, the oh, highest guy I've ever spin it. Yeah. Just never deploy a parachute. Did he die? No, that guy no. lived. But he almost what? got caught in like a flat spin or something. I think. Go catch him? No, no, no. There's no one else up there. He was Who, in fucking space. Iron Man. He's <laughs> <laughs> gonna catch him. <laughs> Take it easy, basketball cat. Are you fucking? <laughs> A lot of those guys have like teams that like film photography. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, he was like in space. Oh, yeah. he jumped out of like a moon capsule. Yeah. <laughs> it was crazy. Yeah. Did he hit it? <laughs> No, I've seen that guy before. Shoot. Eventually, that guy's no. Cool. He steps. It's hilarious how fast he goes. As soon as he yeah. steps out, it's just <laughs> like, oh, yeah, it's crazy. There's no air. This is like so eight years just ago. Ripping. Yeah. How would he survive? If he was not he pulled a parachute, parachute eventually. Oh. That's all right. I think we're gonna switch over. Yeah, let's right. go to the patch round. We're what, um, hour twenty one minutes. God oh, that's damn. it. I thought it was longer. We got to go get fucked up. Yeah. You guys got to go do Are You Garbage? Yeah, yeah. it's Ooh, a drinking be Thanks fun. for doing it, guys. Yeah, thanks yeah. for thanks thanks doing it. Yeah, thank thanks you for having us. It's a blast, dude. Yeah. It was awesome. Guys, it's, it's been so fun. Yeah. <laughs> You're going to be in LA? Yeah. You should come down to... I'm coming. All right, nice. I'm coming. It's going to be good. I'm a bees there. That's be All fun. right. Yeah. Thank yeah. you. Bye.